Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're playing Red Dead Redemption 2. This is part 5 of my let's play. And so in the last episode, we went to collect a debt. And we also went... Uh, we were also in a bar fight. So now, we're gonna go... Down here to have you actually because actually, no, we're gonna go over here, we're gonna go here to calm us down, and I'm pretty sure we have to go collect a debt from him, okay. so we're gonna go and do that now. Oh yeah. <clears throat> hey there. Moment please. Yeah. All right, easy now. Um All right. So there, mister. We're just going to get to the the mission? Yeah, I want to auto save. And <clears throat> then after we do that, we're gonna do Dutch's mission. The one in camp. And if we have time, we might do her other mission. You know what? Have a chance. You know? Oh, oh, yes, yes, perfect. Hey, what the hell? Get away from me. What do I do? I don't know if that was the good thing you were the bad thing to do because I think we're the prisoner. And also here we are. Retreated that from Mr. Downs. You uh, uh, whatever do you want? <coughs> oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm I'll... Really? Threaten me, would you? Uh, please. I have a family, sir, please. I don't care about your family. You owe me money. Why'd it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't... You ain't such a dude, are you? If you're running out on debts... I'm, I'm not running anywhere. I'm... If I'm here, there's a reason I'm here. You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> Where's our money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman! My husband isn't well! If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money! I think that guy might die if he's not already dead. I think I might have just killed that guy. <clears throat> Yeah. 
Right, I'm just getting out of that waypoint. Leghorn chicken. Mr. Strauss. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Well, people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. Right there. <clears throat> Oh, what's this? Oh, I can chop firewood. Right, there's the last piece of wood. Finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. And they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur, what? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah. Of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur? No crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Now I'm gonna have to go to Micah. A strawberry. <clears throat> I 
Rush the Valentine's saloon. I rode as fast as I could, didn't stop for nothing. Hey, you look like you've been through it. <sighs> I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was. You worry too much, kid. Just just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Mike knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was Drake that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? No, oh, nothing big. No, we kept it clean. We're all good. <laughs> if you say so, Arthur. Why don't you take your problems elsewhere? Here we are. What the hell's Let wrong me with you? I have a drink. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. You'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Micah... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, there, Dullards! My lord, you men is dull. <laughs> <laughs> and leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. <laughs> but me and the kid here, well, we're trying to talk business, so could you... Possibly leave us alone. No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just, just trying to be friendly. <laughs> oh. But I, th I think that's more than just one or two drinks. I have to find Lenny. Lenny! Hey, Lenny! Lenny? Lenny, where are you? Can't find my friend. You know where it went? What are you doing? Here he is. Hello, Arthur. You know what? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> 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 Man, why ain't you never married? That's the thing you see. I think they're a bit drunk. Lenny? Oh, he's gone again. Who do you think you're talking to? Nobody. I'm talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get lost, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah, 
Shut your mouth, mister. <laughs> Correct. That's not that's not Lenny, is it? Oh. Well, I'm gonna slap Lenny. Oh, okay, no, I can't slap him anymore. They'll never take me alive, I'm gonna get away. Yes, I made it out. I made it away. <clears throat> That's easily the best mission in the game. Lenny! Is that actually gonna wake up? Or what? Finished. What's this meant to mean? Yeah. All right. So, why am I all the way out here? So, 
I'm gonna do a whole thing of mission, I'm gonna end, then I'm gonna end the video, and then in the next video I'm gonna make my way over here and do these missions. Where even is my horse? Oh my god, my horse is all the way in Valentine. Big China pig. Old spot pig. Hey partner, how are you? Hmm. Yeah, do you smoke, sir? Sure. Oh wait, I actually oh I actually just had a stranger mission. No, no, don't worry about these. Actually, well, take some, take a couple of packs. Take a few. Oh, thank you. <laughs> What are all the cigarettes for? Are you heading on a long journey or something? <coughs> no, 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 nothing like that at all. I'm just interested in the cards. Okay. The cigarette cards. Oh, you got any? Yeah? Well, get them out. Let me take a look. Come on, come on. A little picture card? Yeah, I'll pay you a good price. Okay. Here. Ah, nothing I haven't got. The value is in completing the set. Sometimes I'll smoke up to 200 cigarettes in one day, just so I can keep opening the packs. I That's wish I could things. you the pleasure and the pain I get out of collecting these babies. Sure. Uh, it sounds, uh... Thrilling? Yeah, it is. Not to mention the vast amounts of life-reaffirming cigarettes I get to smoke. Oh, and the amount of money. <laughs> a veritable fortune, sir. Fortune? Oh, sure, sure. A complete set of any series is worth a fortune. Yeah, look at this. Gunslingers. Over here, circus freaks. Yes, yes, yes. Meow meows of the desert. So rare. I never knew. Sure. How much? Well, it depends on the rarity, sir. Oh, of course. Yeah. But, you know, if you ever get a complete set, I can uh, take it off your hands. And you'd pay me. A fair price. Now, you send them to me right here. Phineas T. Rampart, at your service. Okay, I gotta run. This is my train. Look me up, okay? Think about this deal. Only a complete set. That's where the value lies. Well, the industry just got in. Collect all the cigarettes had the melting pretty heads to finish. Oh, wait, yeah. Wait a second. Oh, the train's long gone. I'm hoping to get onto it. <clears throat> The train's going the wrong way, so I can't like... Wait, is it? Oh no, it's not! Oh, well, now it is. <clears throat> Oh, 
Why can't I not set up a camp? Oh my god! I I eat the assaulted the assorted salted apple. I guess I'd have to like run to the horse rover if I could do the mission. <clears throat> Well, I'm out of stamina. Who goes there? Arthur, dumbass. You're alive. Good. You got guard duty again? I like it. Oh, that should really close. I thought I was forever away from camp. Yeah. Jose? You want to go hunting? What oh, I guess we're going hunting. Elephant? I wish. No. I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God. But you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Well, where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now, unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big, loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him, you could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on them. Let's get going. I have, to, I have to get rid of this horse? Well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses, and the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. Easy, boy. This is uh. fun, Arthur. He won't throw me? No, he's an angel, if I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Easy, big feller. All right, let's head into town. And maybe stay out of the saloon this time. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that <coughs> saloon in Deer Creek. Ah, oh, I remember now. Just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes. Remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day, and he woke up and started right back drinking again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well... Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. 
I'm going to put my hat back on. Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. <clears throat> All right, go sell that big brute and buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going off to the general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What about this one here? Yeah, you looking to sell? I sure you. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's going to affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. You'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable them here for you. Here, take a look. Right, so I'm gonna sell the Shire. And then let's see. I'll buy the American Standard Bread because it's all I can afford. And. Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to name him. Okay, I have to, I have to actually name him. I'm just going to name him Horse for now. Alright, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers. And on me, a new grooming brush. And some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you. You treat this fella well. I know he's going to look after you just fine. All right, here we have my horse. <clears throat> I guess we'll see. Okay, boy. Let's go. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains. I sure didn't figure on that. But this time we're <coughs> doing the chasing. So how are things <coughs> with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for oh. a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. I think we need to head right up here. Yes, I remember this place. Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way.
the lake there. Good. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Yep. I should really be heading back over to Great Plains to see about Sean. It's bounty hunters who've got him. So Trelawney says. Javier and Charles have gone with him to scope it out. Pretty dangerous going anywhere near Blackwater. Right, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Of course. Look there. Rabbits. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. You just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before. <laughs> Yep, yep. Wait. Good job. All right. It's getting late. Wreck we should camp here. Sure. Well then you get a set up. <clears throat> oh, I have my mic I had my mic for a bit. Rabbit, then. No. Delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. Okay, now I have a little camp. But what are we gonna cook? What are we gonna cook? Nice plain game. There's literally nothing on that knife. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. Right here. <clears throat> All right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. You better be I, we have to sleep. Off. We have to sleep until morning. It's the only option. So, are you pretty sure you're hunting a bear? Morning, Arthur. You ready? Oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. There you go. So, what's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait then shoot from the trees but i prefer to hunt on the ground more dangerous but we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in and if he bolts we can start right off after him can you mix up this bait for me while i finish packing this up fish berries i tie it up in that rag when you're done i hope you know what you're talking about all right we have to I grew up in the mountains arthur we have to make some potent predator bait what else is there? We're just the same boy. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Just mix it okay. together. It's not too hard. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. Yeah. Have your stuff. Let's go. We can use the campfire to craft Let's a wide, to craft a wide range of planner. I it didn't finish it again. Luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? 
I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? Yeah, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. Didn't last long. <clears throat> I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's... Yeah, let me just check. Oh, but we're like... really far away. We're back up in the Grizzlies. Try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? Let's look by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh Prince. Half-eaten fish. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Over there. Something else on the ground, just here. There's shit here. Watch your step. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. Yeah. Looks like the trail ends here. We lost him? For now. Uh, a little optimism, Arthur. Uh, well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work? Which do you think? Let's bait here. Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. Are those boulders up ahead looks like a good spot for it. More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Give me a hand here. Got your knife? Shit. Easy. Now it's too close. <laughs> you 
You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. <clears throat> nothing at all. <laughs> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> he said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. Oh, so I'm not like you again. You saved my life. Well, <laughs> yeah. I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well. Yeah, no, I'm going for there. I'm coming with you. Let's get going then. All right, we're back. Let's see if Dutch gives us any crap about disappearing like that. I don't need another. We gotta be out there making money speech. We were just out scoping a lead. He doesn't need to know it was a big furry one. Well, thanks, Arthur. I probably owe you one. Don't worry about it. I need to head out to Emerald Ranch soon. Look into something. See you later. All right. New horses are available to purchase in the Valentine's Scarlet Medals and Strawberry Sables. <clears throat> yes, Miss Grimshaw. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary? Yes. I never liked that woman, Mr. Morgan. Funny business. You're now on multiple horses. You can source a tree at the stables. Your previous horse in the stable for you. Glad to be off that mountain, Mr. Pearson. Yes, indeed. All right, let's see. So... We have no missions except these two. Although we're wanted dead or alive here. Is this is this Blackwater here? I think it is. I probably want to want the dead or alive. So I'll go and do these two missions in the next episode. So I'm gonna end it off here. So goodbye and see you in the next video.